back in 1971, President Richard Nixon temporarily, he said, <laughs> took the dollar off the gold standard, which if you don't understand how currency, fiat currency works, basically up until that point, the only dollars that could be put into circulation were those dollars that were backed by new ounces of gold that had been mined from the earth. The reason why the U.S. dollar was backed by gold and why gold has been used as money for 5,000 years is because it can't be created out of nothing. It can't be printed. It can't be manufactured. It has to be mined, which is a slow and steady and extensive and difficult process. So the supply is pretty much known. But here's Richard Nixon back in 1971, removing the gold standard, which he lied and said was only temporary over 50 years ago. <laughs> Just a temporary little solution to America's money problem, uh, which then allowed the Federal Reserve to just print unlimited amounts of money. I have directed the Secretary of the Treasury to take the action necessary to defend the dollar against the speculators. I have directed Secretary Connolly to suspend temporarily the convertibility of the dollar into gold or other reserve assets, except in amounts and conditions determined to be in the interest of monetary stability and in the best interest of the United States. Up until this point, for every dollar that was put into circulation, it had to represent a dollar's worth of gold that was in possession by the U.S. Treasury. But since we're off the gold standard and have been for over 50 years now, now they literally just make money out of thin air. 